Today the event will end later. Sure. We'll talk another time, okay? A kiss. Hey, 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 hey. Where do you think you're going? Get out of here. We're waiting for someone important and we don't want people of your race hanging around. Sorry, sir. I just had a hard time parking the car. But I'm the one you've been waiting for. Can you let me know I've arrived? Are you the one we've been waiting for? And I'm the President of the Republic. Look, people dressed like you would never walk into a company like this. What does my clothes have to do with it? Do you think clothing defines character? You are very much mistaken, sir. You're all elegant and you're not treating me right. I won't waste my time with you. I'm going to speak for the last time. Get out of this company now. Lord, they're waiting for me. I just had a hard time parking my car. Your car? This can only be a joke. Do you really think someone of your ilk would have a vehicle like that? I bet you stole it from someone. I've never stolen anything from anyone. Look, I'm in awe. She never stole anything from anyone. Look, I had an idea. Let's do the following. Looking at you, we realize that you're looking for alms. So I'll give you some coins. And I hope it gets you out of here now. I'm going to count to three. Or do you want me to call the police? Oh, perfect. Perfect. Call the police. Or better yet, call your boss. I want to know what he'll think when he knows he's mistreating me. But it's pretty cheeky, huh? But I liked the idea. I'm going to call my immediate boss just so you can see that he thinks just like me. Hello? Mr. Roberto? Hi, Amadeu. So, has the person we're waiting for already arrived? Not yet. I called because I have a little problem here at the door of the company. There's a pauper here wanting to get in, but you can rest assured that everything is under control. Amadeu, solve everything there. Nothing can go wrong, you've got to make everything perfect. But don't forget, you have to treat this person very well, you know? Super well. You can leave it to me. Well, my boss has more to do. This means that you won't be able to join the company. I'm not going in. Just wait. What are you doing? Are you crazy? I'm going to call Patricia. She's long overdue. But what's that noise? Oh my god. Stop making that noise. You're a freak. She had to be admitted to the asylum. That's what you deserve. For mistreating people. Stop it. But what's going on out there? Nothing can go wrong today. Amadeus. What's going on there, Amadeus? What's that noise? Nothing can get in the way of today's event. The person will arrive at any moment, we are waiting and nothing can go wrong. Amadeus. It's not possible. I'm going to have to go down and work it out myself. Hello? Hello? Drug. I couldn't hear a thing. It's enough for me. But I'm going to end this story. I'm going to call the cops, you thief. I'm not a thief. I'm the owner of this car. And you know what? I'm the owner of this whole building. You're a freak. Now that's who you are. A feeble-minded. Oh, I'm the owner of this car. I'm the owner of this company. Do you think I'll fall for yours? It looks like it. Look, for your government. You ragtag. This company here the owner is a man. Do you really think a woman is going to own all of this? What are you saying? 
Do you think that a woman doesn't have the same capacity as a man? Know that there is. I'm just stating the obvious. A woman is only good for two things. First, to take care of the house, wash, iron, cook, raise the child. And second, to suck the husband's money. Definitely, a woman doesn't own this company. Get in the know. I'm the owner of this company, yes. Do you know what I do with your document? Stop it. Now it's done. I'm going to go in. No, you're not going to join this company. Amadeus, what's going on here? Boss, this filthy woman. Marginal. It's looking to break into the company. Chief. Why are you dressed like that? Chief? But Patricia, I tried to call you and you didn't answer. What happened? I was being humiliated by this employee. I'm sorry, but how was I supposed to know that the person we were expecting was a woman? And even more dressed like that. I was just doing my job. Your job is to treat people well, regardless of their bank account or the way they're dressed. But Patricia, why are you dressed like that? I met a lady on the street. Lady? No lady, I'm already leaving. Don't be afraid. I'm not going to do anything. I just came to give you this. For me? Wow, lady. But, there's a lot of good stuff in here. I don't think I can even use all of this. Why would you give me so much? You deserve it. Everyone in this life deserves to be treated with respect and have a dignified life. Damn, lass. Yes, thank you very much. Imagine. God bless you, lady. Oh, I'll give you my card. If you need it, you can call me. I'm sorry, young lady. It's just that I slept without a blanket and ended up getting sick. I already know what I'm going to do. But, what about you? You're going to get cold. It's too cold. No problem. What matters is that you're well warmed up. I'll wear anything. Yes, I've got. Look, I. I've got this bag of clothes they gave me. I think, I don't even know if you'll want to wear it, but you can wrap it up a little. Who says I wouldn't? The lady is. He doesn't even look like a real person. It looks like an angel that God sent from heaven. And that's how I ended up dressed like this. Mrs. Patricia, I ask your forgiveness. Amadeu, stop with this little theater. We don't want people like you in our company. Can take your stuff and you're fired. But, Mr. Roberto, I didn't know she owned it. So, do you mean that you only treat people who have money well? Amadeus, it's not like that. Everyone deserves to be treated with respect. No one is better than anyone else. Mrs. Patricia, I beg for your forgiveness. I know I've done wrong. By the way, unfortunately I made two mistakes. First, because I treated you badly. And second, because one day I was also homeless and unfortunately I ended up treating you the same way they treated me. I know I've ended up being a monster. But I ask you to forgive you from my heart and I promise that I will change. Amadeus, take your things and leave here kindly. Wait. You can stay. Are you serious? Really? Yes. Everyone deserves a second chance. Thank you, ma'am. But he's done you wrong. He didn't help you. And yet you'll forgive him? I've already said. Everyone deserves a second chance, Roberto. 
Thank you very much, see? From the heart. I learned a lot from that lesson, and without a doubt today I am coming out as a thousand times better person. I only demand one thing, Amadeus. May you start treating everyone with respect here. Regardless of the clothes you're wearing or your financial situation. I promise, you can trust me. And thank you so much for giving me one more chance.